the JNU Sedition Saga unfolds, we bring you live updates from the Jawaharlal Nehru University campus where Umar Khalid and four other students have returned. Which way is our country heading? How can the guardians of law take law in their hands? These are some of the questions that JNU Students President Kanhaya Kumar's lawyer Rajiv Varma asks in a special interview with The Quint. Watch the full interview and other exclusive interviews only on The Quint. At least 16 people dead and 150 injured in Haryana, but the state government said that the situation is returning to normal. National highways are finally being cleared. At The Quint, we also have ground reports that talk about how the issue has become about a lot more than just reservation. Three militants have been killed in anti-terror operations in Pampor, which ended after a three-day-long gunfight today. Two army captains have also been martyred in this operation. In news just coming in, MS Dhoni has suffered a back spasm while training in Bangladesh for the Asia Cup. Parthiv Patel has been called in as a backup. Head on over to the Quinn to get an exclusive interview with Parthiv where he talks about his India comeback. Did you know that Nija Banot was a well-known face in the ad world during the 80s? I'm sure you will remember that face once you see the vintage ads we have put together. Samsung has refreshed its Galaxy S7 lineup this year at the NWC 2016 and you know what's the best part about it? It's finally waterproof. What happens when hundreds of students get together with the cars that they've built themselves? Well, an epic race. For that story, head on over to the site. You can also download the app which is now available on Android and iOS.